Hey everyone and welcome to Shuriken Skills number 62 here in the Work Smarter Not Harder dojo with me, Tony Harmer aka The Design Ninja. This Shuriken skill is to learn about a tool that you can use as a super powered clipboard in InDesign and that tool is the Content Collector and you should be able to tap B on your keyboard to access it You'll know when you have because this content collector window will appear. Now it has two modes down in the bottom left hand corner of the panel. You can see in and out. So basically collect and place. You can toggle between those by tapping B and you'll see they change. So get the icon on the left so it's in collect mode. And then let's just go through and pick up some of these images from this layout. And you can get text and other things as well. I'll go up to the previous page here and I'll pick up that logo just there. And you can see I've got all of my content here in the collector. I'm going to tap B. And what I'll do to start off with, so now I'm in place mode, is I'll move my cursor out onto the document. And just before I place, I'm going to make sure that the three icons that are down the bottom here that I've got the middle one selected place multiple and keep in conveyor okay because otherwise it will just flush them from the conveyor and you can place them elsewhere and then they're gone so we'll keep them here I'm going to use the right arrow to cycle forwards and the left arrow to cycle backwards to get the next item I want maybe this rucksack just here and then I'll just drag out like so and you can see that another one is loaded into the cursor. I'm just going to hold down the command key, that would be control on Windows, and just bring that more into the position I would like, like so. I'm then going to swap out to another document. So I've got one here, a completely separate document, and I'll place a few more of these. I'll just move the conveyor out of the way, and I'll cycle to the next item I want to load. So this one just here. And I'll just drop that one down there, like so. And I'll cycle to the next one, maybe this one here, and bring that in. And I think I've got room for one more, so let's just bring this yellow one in as well, like so. Okay, and I think I'll get the logo there too. So I'll just bring that one in and drop that up at the top there nicely. Even if I move into a new document, I can carry on using this so if i just create a new document alt control n or option command n to do that quickly and bypass the dialog and what i'll do now is tap v on my keyboard you can see that the collector disappears and i'll start to draw i'll just draw maybe a frame on here or a shape so if i just draw a shape here like so across the top and i'm going to swap out the fill and stroke there by holding down shift and tapping X and then again I'll tap B to get my content collector and now I can just come along and bring all of those things in you'll notice these are all still linked so these ones are from Creative Cloud okay but if they were normal links they would still link back to the directory that they came from initially and there you are that's how you can create a super powered clipboard in InDesign, it stays there until you start hitting the escape key to flush everything that's in there. And that's your shuriken skill to practice this time. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, hit the bell for notifications, and feedback to me here or via Facebook or Twitter. But for now, we're done, and I'll see you next time for another shuriken skills episode. See ya.